27 EBS volunteers in Hungary from different countries met in Hortobaj to get to know each other and to spend some quality time together. Let's take a quick look what happened during these days. And now, a little bit slower, step by step. First, defining a perfect volunteer. <laughs> so this is our volunteer. It's uh, open-minded, interested in culture, new things and uh, new people, getting to know them. I like those energizer actions in, in the morning. After that, the fun begins. Have you ever tried what it is like to be blind? Yes, uh, one person had uh, was blind and the other person uh, leads her. And after 10 minutes uh, they changed and then the blind person um, could speak, but the um, seeing person wasn't allowed to speak anymore. And it was really... Uh, a uh, good experience, I think. <sighs> Welcome to the marketplace. But no usual marketplace. There are tasks to do here and things to accomplish. The water, I don't know the name. The water uh, from the um, wall. The, the well water, yes, because I have not so much strength in my, in my arm. It was very painful for, for my back. And I did it just two times, but with a lot of pain. Okay, the most challenging must have been the boat throwing because we had to coordinate ourselves and sometimes we were going to, into the reeds, then into the reeds again. So it was kind of challenging in that way. We had really to coordinate ourselves into going straight forward. So it's kind of a metaphor for things if you don't coordinate quite well, we are going to bump in, into things all the way. And how about the short role play? We had a situation, somebody is sick and um, his friends found him on, on the ground and uh, the doctor and uh, his nurse didn't speak English. We need a doctor! He's very sick. And uh, we had to solve. Me and my nurse, who was a guy. <laughs> <laughs> there was also time and place for something more serious. Some kind of discussions which uh, opened some new uh, point of views uh, about uh, those Hungarians, for example. I like the, the result that one group made. It's like, like puzzles. If you see something Romanian or Ukrainian people, they are uh, really Hungarian. Always says we are Hungarian. After that, some relaxing activities followed. I tried, I, and I and I stressed the word "try" to make a bracelet. Uh, Nemzi, Nemza, the wool bracelet. You know, turned out so bad that I transformed it into my key handler. I don't know. I enjoyed them. I looked at the material and I said, I, I want to work with this. So. It was colorful and I, I like this kind of handwork to make wearable things. So I decided I went for that one. Let's start. The Pusta Rally. 
We had to um, go by bike to different points in Hotobat uh, and uh, we found um, a pencil and we had to there you go, cross. We came now. This step. This is it. It was not a race, but about cooperation. Yeah, let's yeah, let's do it. Everybody did a great job, really. But something out of the ordinary. I liked to enjoy the water bird watching. It was nice to contact the nature and see something which for me it's quite kind of unusual. I can't see birds in, back in Portugal, but this way, surrounded by the noise of the birds, getting so close and maybe able to observe them. And because I had to go there by bike, which I enjoy it a lot, but I don't do that much in Portugal. This one is quite up and down town. The culture program took us to the visitor center and pastor museum. And what about the culture? What was the most interesting in the museum? I went to the to the museum and I was seeing uh, videos for the for the life of the pastors and to see the making the food. A quick visit to the bird hospital was followed by exploring the pusta. Both the bird watching and go with the horses. I like to see how they do the things, you know. See how they like ride the horse and like the guy was having like, I don't know, four or three horses and he was like on top of them, two of them. Just riding, it was really amazing. Days full of exciting activities left their mark. But although it might have been tiring, it was a great opportunity to exchange experiences and make new friends. And after that, everyone could happily return to their everyday volunteering life to fulfill their dreams with greater energy and new ideas. <laughs>